Hello, my friend. How are you doing? Last classes, we studied examples using should to give advice and suggestions. You should follow our methodology. Deberías seguir nuestra metodología. You should like our classes. Deberías dar, dar un like a nuestras clases. You should speak English. Deberías hablar inglés. You shouldn't sleep a lot. No deberías dormir mucho. Esta acabo de inventar. But we studied should. Should in affirmative, negative, and interrogative. But we can use other expressions to suggest things, to give advice. Should is the most used, es la más utilizada. Pero tú puedes decir, why don't you take your sunglasses? ¿Por qué no llevas tus sunglasses? You could take your credit cards. ¿Podrías llevar? Why don't you call your mother? ¿Por qué no llamas tu mamá? You need to pack your things. Necesitas empacar tus cosas. So, we are using different expressions to suggest things. You could, podrías. Why don't you, por qué no, you need, necesitas. Ejemplos. You were going to travel with your friends. I tell you, why don't you take a backpack? Why don't you make a copy of your documents? Why don't you take your cell phone with you? Another situation. You are going to travel abroad. You are going to travel to a different country. I tell you. Why don't you get your passport? You need your passport. You need to exchange some money. You are going on a business trip. I tell you. You could take some leaflets from your company. You could make a reservation early. You could go online to see what you can do there. Now, I'd like you to invent. Invent one example using you could, one example using why don't you, and one example using you need. Comment your examples here, I want to see them. Share this class with your friends. Thank you very much. I'm Felipe Gibi. See you next class. In this class, we see three expressions to soften should. Tres expresiones para suavizar el should. A veces puede sonar muy strong, fuerte.